Footballville, man. Listen here, we got some Thursday night football going on tonight. We got Columbus versus South Dade headed out there. Cover some football for y'all. Um, let me let me highlight y'all about something. Listen, listen. Just today at high school, young boy got caught with a gun in his book bag. I'm not sure what he was gonna do with the gun, but now he expelled with school from school, probably charged, toting a firearm, bringing a firearm on school. It's just the beginning to a bad, bad situation. I want to tell you like this. The decisions you make today will show up tomorrow. Good or bad? The decisions you make today will alter your future, good or bad. If it feels bad, leave it alone. If it don't feel right, leave it alone. Let me tell you a short story. I'm an officer, I'm an officer. I work in the jail. One I came in the jail, was a young boy in there, big boy, big chest, dreads. Man, this young boy, he may be 19, 20 years old. Let's say his name was Kiwan Johnson. I was talking to him. He said he needed some toilet paper, so I brought him some toilet paper. And then he, somebody put me to the side. And they was like, you know who that is? I was like, nah, I don't know who that is. They was like, you know who? He played with Miami Northwest in 2018, 2007, 2018, undefeated for two years, national champions. National champion. Yeah, he was a linebacker. He played with Corey Harris, Sean Spence, Kimbrell Tompkins, Tommy Streeter, Darius Johnson. All these kids at school, the University of Miami. So I'm wondering, um, what happened to you? So I go ask him. I ask him what happened. He was at University of South Florida. Came home for a break. Went out with some friends and the night ended in him being arrested with multiple charges of armed robbery and some other stuff. I watched this young man for maybe two or three years. Not talk much, sad, uh, depressed. Um, I'm sure if he had that night back, he'd do things different. College scholarship gone. Now you fight for your freedom. The decisions you make today will show up in your future, good or bad. Now he has some fortitude. He got clear, he got out of jail. He fought his way back and ended up playing for Tuskegee. College. And when I saw him on the field, brought a tear to my eye. Because that's a long road he took. When he could have just took the shortcut in the beginning. By making the right decisions. The decisions you make today will show up in your future. Good or bad. Be careful who you hang around. Be careful what you do. Footballville, man. We out here. Go watch some football, bro. Rico on the beat.
football video? Huh? What y'all like watching? What y'all watch on football video? Highlights or something like that. Huh? Highlights. What's your favorite part of it? I just like watching the highlights. Yes, sir. Highlights all day. Y'all subscribe? Yes, sir. Yeah? Yes, sir. They got y'all on phones? Yeah. All right, now. <laughs> Okay, early third quarter. South Day down 17 to 7 to Columbus. South Day just amounted a drive, got to the Columbus 20 yard line and threw an interception. Columbus ball. Question of the day. Question of the day. Listen up. Question of the day. The NFL, Thursday night football, is showing you a view that's similar to the John Madden view. Question of the day, do you like that view better than a traditional view? Question of the day, the NFL tonight, Thursday Night Football is showing you a view, they're trying something new, they're showing you a view similar to the John Madden football view from up, from up top. Do you like that view better than the traditional view? Leave it in the comment box below, let us know how you feel about it. Footballville, Columbus South Day, we out here. We got University of Miami commit DJ Ivy out here. 101. Let's, let's see what DJ Ivy do the next play.
Yeah. 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 Yeah.